Hello guys, time for another fishing video. It's 31st of October today and it's very foggy. I don't know, maybe this will bring us some luck with the fishes. Let's see how it goes. Let's go! So since my uh, shrimps are still solid frozen, I didn't remember to uh, remove them from the freezer fast enough. Uh, I will start uh, to fish with a sabiki rig and try to catch some herring to use as a bait for uh, some flat fishing. So guys, I've been fishing for an hour with the sab sabiki rig for some herring without any luck. So I'm switching to some bottom angling. Let's see if we can catch some flat fish or maybe some cod. So I got a tip from a subscriber to uh, use a string to uh, tie it around the, the bait. Um, and uh, this will uh, keep it in place uh, and increasing the success rate of the fish actually hooking without taking the bait only. So I guess all you do is tie it around like this <laughs> probably doing it wrong but i think it it should be enough and i gotta say i really like when you guys give me tips and advice to use because i'm still learning something like that So just let it sink to the bottom. Tighten the line and then wait. Seems like they're already biting. I think we got a bite. Now the rod is tipping really much, but that is because I'm using 250 grams of weight. There we have it. Oh, that's a tiny say. Beautiful fish, but too small to keep. So guys, I keep getting bites on the bottom ring that I used, but uh, I believe that the hooks uh, are too big because, uh, so I'm switching to the Sabiki rig and using it, oops, as a, as a bottom angling and hopefully it will uh, work better. We got another tiny say, I believe. Yeah. Oops. There we go. But I gotta say that uh, the string uh, to tie around the bait with a string is a really good tip. So guys, I'm gonna do something probably very stupid. <laughs> I'm gonna lower in my GoPro uh, and try to capture uh, some underwater footage uh, while the fish are biting. The thing is that I have been planning to do this in an upcoming video. So I've ordered some underwater lightning. So um, this is the first test without the underwater lightning. I haven't received the lightning yet. So let's see how this goes.
Okay guys, I hope you enjoyed this uh, fishing video, uh, learned some great tip with the string and also enjoyed the underwater uh, spontaneous footage. I actually uh, previewed it a little bit and I was surprised on how good it looked. So as I mentioned before, I'm planning to, big, uh, uh, to build a fishing rig where uh, to fix the, the camera uh, with bottom agony so it's really good shown and uh, that footage will look awesome. So please subscribe on the channel, uh, like, share and uh, comment um, and uh, catch you on the next one.